it is judged in Germany that this surgery has not to be covered by insurance companies. Okay, that's wrong, surely, but what they should cover, first of all, I think this is the, the most important way, first of all, they should cover the conservative treatment, the lymphatic drainage in the compression stockings. This is much more expensive and not every woman wants to have a surgery. Patients are ill, we could help them with lymphatic drainage. This is no discussion, it, 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 it's okay, it works. And the insurance companies say, oh, we, are, we do not think that it's an illness, we will not cover it. It's a lymphatic illness, a lymphatic disease. It's necessary that the doctors not just look to fatty tissue, legs and arms and say the rest is normal. They have to take the typical science of lymphology, they have to be educated in lymphology, they have to know what they are looking for. They have to discriminate a lipolymphedema from a lymphedema, from a secondary lymphedema, paralymphedema, and so on. If they are not able to do this, and they are not educated in these areas, there's none university educating this in America, I know, even not in Germany, uh, then we have a problem. It took me five years to have an agreement with the university in Cologne to become the opportunity to give an education to the students there once a year for, for nearly an hour. It took me five years just to organize it. She might be a little bit typical stadium one to two small lady. As you know, we have as well those type three up to 120 kilograms body weight. Okay. But at the end, this is not a question of the weight, it's a question of the pain necessary to know. So my question is if she has any more pain in this area, no, 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 no. in these areas we did the surgery and she has no more pain in there. That's great. Even here it's painful. It's still lipidema painful. And as you can see as well, it's not a lymphedema. It's fatty tissue. It's solid tissue. If you print in the finger in here, you will not have a pitching or an depression of edema, nothing like this. There is no edema in there, like you want to see this normally in uh, lymphedemas. The German doctors do not believe that this is an illness. They say there's nothing with illness, it's a question of fatty tissue, too much good bother, and I don't know what. So, I think it's a blame as well for the patients, because they have pain, they don't feel not, they just do not feel not good, they just are ill and they need to be helped. And then they come to the specialist, the doctors, and they say, you do not need help, you need less eating. And, uh, how long did you have here? Do you remember? Um, Eighteen years. Eighteen years. Um, Beginning to start in eighteen years. years. You walk like a clown, you are not able to take small steps or uh, do normal things like uh, walk into your car, uh, you need help for everything. The legs are go bigger and then you have uh, pain all the legs from the top to the ground and uh, you have uh, the feeling that uh, the legs are have thousand kilos and uh, all the time ache, yes. My first idea was, I will educate the doctors. I give the information to them. This must be enough to bring out better conditions for the patients. And this idea was wrong, surely wrong. It is necessary to inform the patients themselves. So I went the other way and I said, okay, I will do some videos, bring them to the internet. And then the, uh, the TV shows came as well and told us we want to have a show on uh, lipidema, we want to know something on this. And in this moment we had an array of patients who came to the offices. My mother saw, saw a movie in the television about girls with the same problem and phoned me and said, look, <laughs> I read something in the internet and find uh, Dr. Connelly and so I came. Before I did the operations it was horrible. I wasn't uh, able to do such normal things and uh, it was absolutely the right decision. 
We took uh, 3,000 milliliters of fat away in this air, outer thighs of the legs. Then the next date was a few weeks later, 8th of October, with 1,300 milliliters for the arms, both arms together in one session. And yesterday we did uh, the last 3,000 milliliters on the legs. So these young ladies, uh, we removed 6 liters on fat just in the legs and 1.3 uh, liters in the arms. And what I hope, and she told us, she has no more typical lipidine pain in these areas. What she feels now is that the feeling of healing. This will take up to th three to six months uh, because uh, the skin has to remove the new way between models and the like. And so the patients just tell us that between four and six months, they feel that we did a surgery on them, uh, but they have no more lymphatic drainage or compression stockings, nothing on these. They can go on the day long, whatever they like to do. Yes, I'm absolutely happy. Um, after my first operations, I was able to take uh, high heels uh, to walk as a normal person. It was brilliant, happy, yes. And she did not have any pain. So her quality of life has an increase uh, just now at the moment. She's laughing again. Yeah.